Awesome. That's a holding Hawthorne. The Hawks take the advantage. The impressive day, forward hand pass. On to Moore, a little low ball is really good. That is great forward play. Knee issue, 24 disposals last week, career high. Six goals, career high. For his opening nice. kick, it's an absolute beauty. It just swings in. And Mitch Lewis with the opener for the Hawks. McKenzie, Meek, back to McKenzie. This is oh, good for the Hawks on the outer side. Slight fumble, but there's options forward. And one of them is Bruce, who's had one shot already today. Wasn't able to kick a goal, but you'd fancy. Luke Bruce plays on. And as you would expect, Bruce kicks his first for the afternoon. So go the way Newcomb. Rossi Lyon straight away, he's got Mason Wood against James Sicily now. So he'll try and drag him forward away from that intercept position. Bruce is out the back. That's danger against any team. Look at this man on the left, Lukey Bruce. Wow. That's what he can do. Top shelf, Bruce to 4 9 8. Sinclair trying to track Bruce to start with and then thought, no, I'll go to the goal square. Well, it wasn't his direct opponent to it start with. They're back in place. Thank you to Sarah Jones alongside Dermot Barrett and Nick Del Santo. Fox footy Saturday afternoon on a big day coming your way all day and all night. Warple. Gee, that's a great. Lewis is in front position. That is awesome clearance work from a boundary line throw in. That off the boot earlier. Recognise it like a top, top spin. Kick the opening goal of the match to Mitch Lewis from directly in front. Kicks his second. Well, it's great. Return. This is when you, you get your best bang for buck. So it's via handball instead of a rush kick out of there. Wasn't the prettiest kick of the football, Doom? The but first it Frost. For the one two is Mitchell. Bramble doesn't require it, takes it himself. Slides one down the line. Good use of the body, ends up in the hands of Butler. Sends it deep forward, Brockman, we talked about his toe, he'll play on Brockman and break a runner four. He gives off the quick handball and that's why the ball's in motion. Looks like Butler then unloads and he does have some toe and he's got his talent all over afternoon, Bell. This is not really a scoring kick but they've struggled to retain it. Webster kicked in a hurry, had a little bit more time than he thought. McDonald, the sub, gets himself involved. Weddle by hand. Impey from 50. Pulls the trigger, Jarman. Impey! Tight, but I reckon it's home. No one quite sure. Up by says it is. Just a little bobbly kick here from Jimmy Webster, and then trying to be a little too cute, Mason Wood. So here's the opportunity. No, I can't get it. Goes back outside 50. That's a great finish off a step. Gets himself organised. They know able to kick across his body. One, two, bang. Great hit. Newcomb, Day. Creates a little bit of space for Nash. Clever hand pass inboard. The Hawks played it nicely. Day can hit a target inside. He's looking for the man out the back. McDonald coming back with a flight. Burns. Spills free. Goal for the Hawks. They worked it hard, got it to Butler, and the Hawks won't be denied. On the football, prepared to hold on to the footy until they eventually find Day, who's facing forward with a little bit of space. It's a great contest. Big Lloyd says, no, nope, I'll handball it to a smaller, like all tall people should. <laughs> See, it's a lovely finish. With the stoppages. Now it's the Hawks' opportunity. Last three goals before the last five going the way of St Kilda. Will Day versus Ford. Another the contest. Good contest there. Lewis. Bruce. He's kicked two. Luke Bruce steps through. Thought he could have almost had a shot. Gave it across to the big man who pops it through. So Mitch Lewis replies courtesy of Bruce. And the Hawks get one back. So it's almost a laconic style. You don't realise how fast he's moving because he looks like he's doing it in second or third gear. So there's the initial give, and then he's gone. Brad Crouch can't touch him. Puts immediate pressure on that defence of the Saints. He did well, Mitch Lewis, then. I thought he was going to get shoved under the ball by Dougal, but he was still able to at least make a drop. Oh, of the oh, he got one-on-ones ahead. Use him. More Nash. <laughs> Look at the size of the man. He just shrugs off Webster. Ran into a block of granite. Sends it to McDonald. Good grab. 
Good grab now. Things are tightening up. Oh, they could, could they? And then you've got to stop and reload. But the size of the man, the encroaching player bounces off him into ground. You know, the Dandenong Stingrays, McDonald pops it home. And now it gets really tight on the scoreboard. Now, this, watch this kick here. Connor Nash, Webster. Most blokes knock the marking player to ground, and then you have to reload. There's an extra three seconds on the play. But because he's so big... Dangerous well, position for the Saints. The ball hits turf. Burns, important kick out of defence. Ah, Jarman Imp is in best position. A lot of players ahead of the footy. The leads come. The big boys want it deep. He sees something in the pocket. It's a perfectly weighted play kick. On. Moore does play on. Here's the big finish. All of a sudden, under the roof. It's a two-point affair. Well, Rossi wasn't happy before. I reckon he might be pushing the button now. 50 in most teams. Most players will go to the top of the goal square. He identified more one-on-one -on -one with Stockett just in front of him. It's a really well-weighted and clever kick. And sums this up very well. Moore does well. Once again, not to go to ground, keeps his feet. So the one thing I'd go with, with, on. with Patton, coming out of defence, and it's only a micro adjustment, but to kick a tumble punt when he could have as easily it's kicked... An important it. kick. It's a good kick too today. You want to go immediately by hand, he does. McDonald jinking his way through the middle of Marvel. He saw Wilkie down the line. He's controlling everything forward of this footy, Callum Wink. Wilkie. We've got a man forward of the footy. That's Moore. Here's the important kick. Doesn't really time, but it'll work out. Kaczynski's missed a couple of opportunities, but he'll line up from 46. Dick Del Santo. What's he got today, Jacob? No goals, too. You called it. Missed a couple of opportunities to make it four in a row for the Hawks. Kaczynski. Huge kick oh, this way. Kaczynski. Two arms in the air. The Hawks from nowhere are in front with the last four. They besiege Kaczynski. 1-24 on the clock. That was a brilliant kick was through it? the middle of the ground from Carl Amon. Aggressive, brave and well executed. But McDonald's, see, up the other end, left-hand side of screen. And you'll also see Wilkie behind there. That's why they had to go sideways. So they played it very well, the Hawks. They did. They created a space to allow Kazitsi to come back up at the football. Yes, he loves it. The outside oh, steal. Did well. Here's a chance. Drives it forward. Doesn't really tie on the ball. Sicily repels yet another attacking thrust. More from players on both sides. That is Stocker. Stocker had eyes for the ball. That was always the easy one there to take the cheap shot. But Liam Stocker, fantastically well done, son. Played the ball. Great footy. Great gutsy footy from both players. Minute six on the clock. Warple bangs it inside. Bruce! Lukey Bruce takes the mark with a game on his boot. He's lining up for career goal 499 and he'll take every second available. Well, they got it. Got to try and find a way to create a goal. This is the consequence. He's kicked so many of these goals in a long career. Luke Bruce to ice the game for the Hawks. Bruce from directly in front. Luke Bruce was never going to miss. Time ticks. Hawks look home. Saints. To save the game, Mo, from the Hawks, structurally at this next centre square bounce. Gee, that's it's just a, a great play. Yeah, right, dude. It's just great positioning. But if you look at the last four to five minutes, Hawthorne's run through the lines has been exceptional. We, we call it, though.